Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN Headline News Update. Good afternoon, everybody. I'm Tommy O'Brien coming to you live from TFNN, 2 p.m. Eastern Time. Two hours left to go in the trading day, and you got markets accelerating to the downside. Uh, not that long ago, I was on the air, 9.30 this morning. The market's open. We had the SPY trading at 4.37, just like that. We've given up almost five points. You talk about an acceleration down to 4.3251. We'll jump over to yields, quite a move in yields as well. You check out the NASDAQ 100. We're off by 98 points right now, making 101 points, off two-thirds percent. You get the Dow off about 1% right now, off 315. The Russell, how about it, off two. 0.5% the Russell you're looking at a 10 year yield a tenth of a percent higher than it was this morning even more than that maybe 4.72% we jump over to the 10 year you talk about a sell off right we get the spike higher on the CPI coming into the CPI this number this morning a little bit of a hot CPI number 0.4% month over month and it's been a one way trip and we are making session lows as we speak and as you get a sell off in yields we have the market selling off as well. And what's that doing to the dollar? You might be able to guess. Putting some strength into the dollar. And you talk about a move, man. Early this morning at 8.30, we're at 105.69. You've added almost a full point in the dollar to 106.54. Yields rising. The 10-year now above 4.72%. You have yields rising across the curve as well. You jump to the two-year, quite a drop-off as well. Not quite the same escalation, though, right? You get the drop-off on the two-year on that 830 number, and then we chop around. Longer term, though, seems like rates are going to have to go higher, man. And we've been talking about the 10-year on a daily basis, right? Quite the reversal right at the upper boundary line of that channel line. Pretty remarkable, man. You turn around on that channel line, and uh, they're requesting the 30-year in the den. You talk about a move, man. Yeah, longer duration. We got it negative two full points on the session, but that's not counting the fact that we were higher coming into that 830 number. Talk about some moves, man. We jump over to retail, though. Amazon, well, they're flat on a negative day. How about Target? Up by 1.1% right now. Walmart, up by 2 tenths percent. Markets in the red. We got to replay this hour, folks. My dad, Tom O'Brien, he's coming up live from 3 p.m. 3 till 4 p.m. Uh, where are we going to be by then? S&P's negative by 40 yields on the rise. Stay tuned, folks. Replaying my show, Tom O'Brien, my dad, live from the 3 The reality is that navigating financial markets can be